We had the one golf course that I inherited when I bought the place. I had a couple of buddies come up there and play, and after we played the links, I thought they would just go, ooh, tee and that wonderful one of them. And instead, he, Dick Stackhouse was his name. He said, gee, Joe, uh, if you're really thinking about building a, almost like a real golf course, <laughs> I'm very close to Pete Dye. I'm from Indianapolis, and he's from Indianapolis. So, after my <laughs> taking back, I thought, well, yeah, well, yeah, why don't you have him come over here? So, um, that's what happened. He, uh, uh, Pete Dye did come over. He walked the course, walked, and uh, all this outcropping you have, you know, all these rocks we have around here, you know, people will say, oh boy, I bet that was a job bringing them on the site. What are you talking about? We, we buried 90% of them, but that outcropping that's indigenous to this Appalachian thing there, you bury, you bury. And so Pete Dye walked around, walked, and he said, gee, Joe, I, I think it's a little too tough. Finally, he said, oh, okay, well, I'll give it a whirl. So uh, he, he produced the thing. And again, I keep saying what I like about him, he details it to the terrain and stuff there. It's not something he sits in an office and figures. No, he walks everything. If you'd walk some of those ways, the way it, there's a big outcropping, he will make the cart path go around. So it's included. So he uses the nature in building the thing. He doesn't change the nature. Did an outstanding job, no, no question about it. Most of these courses that uh, really are up there, some, you know, are steep with tradition. You know, they're 30 and 40 and 50 and 60 years old. Uh, again, Pete Dye, uh, I think that thing's only about 15 years old now. But even going into it, uh, it was a Pete Dye course and stuff. But certainly its maturity has helped it in a few changes. But there have been Vernier adjustments. There haven't been course adjustments or anything. I mean, it started off pretty good, but it got better very, very rapidly. Yeah, it, it, it's truly a, a great, great course. course to build. There were many places where you have this tough, tough stone where you didn't have to do some dynamiting. And then, you know, uh, any wetlands we gave up, we had to make three times the wetlands here. Yeah, it was a hell of an engineering job to get that to where it is today. Mm -hmm.